this is the tale of a poor fisherman, Nevsky Trout, and his wife, Griselda. They live by the seashore in a dilapidated old hovel. Three years and thirty they've lived in there, and now the roof leaks. Griselda's so fed up. Her wash tubs split right down the middle, and wind howls in the windows. Old man, old man, please, please set me free. If you do, then anything you may ask of me, I can repay you a right royal ransom. Thirty-three years I've fished here, and never once have I seen a talking fish. I must tell Griselda. Griselda! Griselda! I've seen a talking fish. It offered to grant a wish, spoke of a royal ransom. I threw it back in the sea to be peaceful. You did what? A royal ransom and you come back here with nothing? Not even a fish finger? You're useless. Get me a decent cottage. Nevsky decides to ask the fish for some help. Oh, forgive me, your majesty, goldfish. I'm sorry to be such a pest. It's my wife. Her nagging robs me of rest. Greed and desire have her hooked. She wants a cottage. Never mind, my friend. On me you may depend. You chose my release and I'm ever thankful. So go in peace. Whoa! A lovely cottage and a new tub. Oh, Griselda, we have all that we need. Why, we can keep hens now and sow seeds. Oh, we could plant potatoes and herbs and leeks. You needn't look so jolly. This place is full of creepy crawlies. Oh, dear little fish, I need a helping hand. Her latest notion, to be the queen of all the ocean. Oh, you, we had more than enough. You had to have your tuppence worth. That little fish was here to help. 